Every uh, mom that's holding their new baby has that same gut protective instinct and wants to do everything they can to make sure their child can um, can survive and thrive. <laughs> has put us in a place where we can help people understand there needs to be an end to babies dying because they're being diagnosed too late. That is really what this project has been all about and we think we can see an end to that. We were invited to put together a, a symposium with the health officials in, in China to educate the clinicians and speak to the public health leaders. And the result was um, a really very strong, robust uh, pilot project being conducted in the more rural part of, of China, so the southwest of China, so that we could really demonstrate how the screening works in those conditions, that it is feasible for health staff to do it, and that if we do identify kids with serious problems, that the treatments are accessible, available, and the kids can have a good outcome good. after the screening. That baby's alive. <laughs> this may well be the largest public health initiative ever initiated on behalf of not just of children, but particularly of newborns and infants. So why not take this throughout the entire world? Why should any baby anywhere have to succumb to any of these complications which can be identified by this technology? Nothing equals the grief of a suffering child or the loss of a child. So my interest personally and professionally is to eliminate that grief and suffering from the face of the earth. I give everyone we've worked with in China so much credit and I commend them on their leadership for taking this on and recognizing that it is going to make a measurable impact in their country and there's a whole bunch of countries, not just in Southeast Asia but around the world that will be looking at their progress in China and we're just so very pleased to have played a role in, in some of this and, um, and where it can go from here. That is a testament to the power of love. No force that we deal with as humans is any greater 